this is your biology tutor and pie so lately we are starting off with food tests all right so our lesson for today is sport test for lipids please bear in mind we are doing experiments okay so we are starting off with sport test for lipids what is it that we want to achieve by the end of this lesson we want to show the presence of a fat by a translucent stain something of this nature we have seen what happens uh, when you put or rather when you accidentally pour cooking oil on your clothes or rather when you accidentally pour cooking oil on, on a piece of paper and so forth there's always a stain that remains behind so that is what we want to demonstrate at the end of the day but now in our experiment we are given a filter paper now our filter paper is divided in spots right remember it's poured test for lipids so you have spot number one you have two you have three and then you have four and down here we are given a key now this key is the one that is guiding us to what we should put at spot number one now we are told that at spot number one we should add oil spot number one you are adding oil spot number two you are adding water whereas at three you are adding oil plus water and then at spot number four you are adding ethanol on one filter paper so it's your filter paper your filter paper you divide it in four spots and then at each spot you are adding what is given down here now what is it that you should expect by the end of the day now because this is oil we all know that oil uh, leave a stain on 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 our materials be it whether it's a paper or rather clothes right so there'll be a stain that will be left here and then at spot number two this is water water does not contain oil now because it does not contain oil your filter paper will dry off at spot number two and then drying off there will be no stain that will be left right and then at spot number three you have oil plus ethanol now because ethanol has the ability to dissolve to dissolve oil there will be no spot that will be left here so your ethanol will dissolve your oil after it's done dissolving your oil because this is alcohol it will evaporate and then dry off and then there will be no stain that will be left as compared to spot number one and then at spot number four this is where you are only adding ethanol you are only adding ethanol now because you are only adding ethanol ethanol does not contain oil and then we know that uh even though even if it had oil still ethanol is going to dissolve oil as we have seen at spot number three so because this is ethanol your ethanol will just evaporate and then after evaporating your spot uh, will dry off and then after drying off there will be no stain that will be left so i'm sure you have seen this in question paper so this is how you answer if they ask for such questions you should be able to reason you should know why there is a spot there why there is no spot why there is no spot and so forth now repeating our results uh at spot number one where there's oil we know that oil it will stain the paper and then it will leave a translucent uh, stain as shown in our picture and then um at spot number two this is water what happens when you pour water on a piece of paper your piece of paper will dry off and you won't even notice uh whether there was uh whether they whether uh there was water on on a certain spot or not for example you get to wash your clothes after you are done washing your clothes there is no stain that will be left why because you have used water and then why also because your water does not contain fats and then at uh, spot number three this is where you have oil plus ethanol now we know that ethanol actually dissolves oil and then when it dissolves oil you have a uh, small fatty globules and then because of that there will be no uh stain of fat that will be left at spot number three your ethanol will evaporate and then because of that spot number three will dry off without having a stain at all and then at spot number four this is where you are only adding ethanol now ethanol does not contain no lipids even though it had lipids your ethanol still it was still going to dissolve your lipids right and then what happens to your ethanol your ethanol will actually dry off and then uh, it will actually evaporate and then 
uh, after that it, your spot will dry off leaving no stain on your filter paper all right so this is how you reason i'll try to look for question papers uh, any questions of us that are asking about this and then i'll also make a video on that and try to answer some of the practicals or other experiments that we look at so that we can prepare you for your final exams which is uh october november if i'm not mistaken please if you have any questions do comment below if uh, you feel like there's a topic that we should tackle also leave your comment below also don't forget to watch our previous videos so please subscribe to our channel so that you can be notified whenever the Paiso family uh, drops a new video all right so thank you so much for your time have a pleasant day